amid cheating rumors involving 90-day fiancés Yvette Arellano and Mohamed Abdelhamid. Fans are quickly taking sides, and many viewers believe that Eve's feelings are authentic. Even Mohamed met after he slid into her DMs, because he'd seen an appealing photo of her in a bathing suit. After chatting all day, the riotous duo realized they had more in common than caring for their bodies, and took their relationship to the next level. Within three months, Eve flew to Egypt, where the couple became intimate and got engaged. When the couple appeared on 90 Day Fiancé, they had been together for almost three years. Although they have a 23-year gap, and significantly different cultural beliefs, Eve was convinced that they were meant to be. She prepared her home, her son, and her heart to welcome Mohammed to America. However, 90 Day Fiancé's Eve was in for several surprises upon her significant other's arrival. Despite Mohammed's previously open-minded mindset about their cultural differences in Egypt, his feelings changed in America. He wasn't fond of the clothes that Eve would wear, or how open her friends were when it came to wanting personal details about his love life. At one point, in a moment of frustration with Eve, who was taking too long to complete his paperwork, he claimed that he would find another sponsor. While Mohammed appeared to become more controlling, and only in the relationship for a green card. Eve appeared more genuine. Relationships are all about giving, taking, and making compromises. Even before 90 Day Fiancé's Mohammed arrived, Eve took it upon herself to make her home and space more comfortable for her fiancé. From installing a bidet, to removing some revealing clothes from her clothes, Eve's number one goal was to make the love of her life feel comfortable and welcome in America. Although she had no intentions of embracing his culture fully, she wanted him to know that she accepted him, and his beliefs. Even when Mohammed became more controlling about her clothes and forbid her from being alone with men in their home, Eve did what she could to keep the peace. To be fair, Eve clearly stated that she had no intention of converting, but that didn't stop her from exploring 90 Day Fiancé's Mohammed's culture and learning more about who he was. Despite her obvious discomfort, Eve wore a hijab and attended a mosque. She gained a deeper understanding of him and tried to incorporate more of his culture into her life so they would both be happier together and to show her support. However, that only seemed to give Mohammed the impression that she would convert. 48 year old Eve is a single mother who has never been married. She wasn't looking for love when Mohammed slid into her DMs. In fact, many times throughout the season, Eve stated that she never thought this would happen. The genuine excitement that Eve displayed gave viewers the impression that she was in love with Mohammed for the right reasons. Although some believe that due to her age and having never been married, 90 day fiancé's Eve was desperate enough to marry a young Egyptian man who gave her some attention. However, Eve declared that she was waiting for the right one. And it was Mohammed who gave her a butterflies in her stomach feeling. Related, all the clues that 90 Day Fiancé's Yvette and Mohammed split up not all relationships work out. In fact, more often than not, couples do need to compromise if they want their relationships to stand the test of time. And this was a lesson that Eve learned early on. She was willing to make minor changes and get to know him better, so they could be stronger as a couple. However, Mohammed's responses, and antics, often gave the impression that he cared more about his status than about the relationship. Considering their tumultuous experience, 90 Day Fiancé fans are not surprised that their relationship issues have escalated.